You know, I think this is a beautiful space, right? How many of you love being here in this space here this evening? And I'm, I'm sure many of you know, but this is a factory of sorts, where graphic imaging is created for large events, like a lot like this one. But early in 2020, it became something else. When the pandemic struck, and the needs of our frontline workers became a matter of life and death. This space was used to manufacture crucial personal protective equipment. Michael Dugall, Chief Executive Officer of Dugall Visual Solutions, said recently, we wanted to help our community and to help keep our team together and to keep the company functioning. When things got tough, we got together and we tried to make a difference as best we could. He made that shift within days. He made a difference within weeks. He even slept in the office, right here in this building, to lead the round-the-clock efforts of his team. But still, he wanted to do more. So later that year, during the holiday season, he donated to St. Jude Children's Research Hospital on behalf of his employees. A truly selfless gift. And it hasn't stopped there. Of course, Michael continues to give. He continues to serve and was gracious enough to donate this beautiful space that we're gathered in here tonight. Because of his generosity, because of his compassion for his selflessness and caring for others during the most challenging of times, I am proud on behalf of everyone at ALSAC and St. Jude to present the Dugall family with the 2022 St. Jude Leading the Way Award. I'd like to ask Michael and Molly to come up and say a few words. Imagine hearing those words, your child has cancer. Imagine being a child and hearing those words. But too many people, those aren't things you imagine, just things they experienced. And the idea that we can help here tonight, that we can continue the amazing work of Danny Thomas, which began as a prayer, but thank God for St. Jude's. Literally, thank God for St. Jude's, because this whole mission started as a prayer. And then we had the courage and commitment to honor that prayer with his actions and deeds, which got us to a place where we took child mortality rates down from 80% to 20% in the United States. There's few things as pure as what St. Jude's does. So often in what we, in our world today, there's so much conflict, there's so much animosity, there's so much political charge. It's amazing to support a group that just cares. And cares they do, they, they take care of the family, they take care of the siblings while they're there, they take care of the child. They do things that are so amazing. And what I'd like to do right now is turn it around to the people who work at St. Jude's. Can you just please stand up or wave your hands if you work for St. Jude's? And we, can we just thank all those people who work at St. Jude's for everything they do? For us, this is an evening. For them, it's a battle every day. And they're blessed to be able to see the triumphs of so many children having their destinies and lives changed by the gracious donations that you guys have all made here tonight. Thank you so much for coming. We're honored to receive this award. We're thankful to be in position to give, because it is a blessing. Everyone who gave tonight, you are blessed, because you're blessed to be in a position to give, and nothing feels as good 
I've been in many mountaintops and I've been in many valleys, but nothing feels as good as helping someone else. So thank you from the bottom of our hearts for all you've done.